Hi everybody, welcome to our digital kennel, GermanShepherdMan.com. I'm Charles Miller, German Shepherd Man, and this is Ruby the Jewel, and she is a jewel. Ruby, okay, good girl. Now, Chuck in Tennessee wanted me to go through a training sequence. Hold on a second. Star and Sergeant. Wanted me to go through a training sequence. That's the sign for hush. Uh, and they're going to get cranked up because they all love this ball. This is the Chuck It ball for Chuck in Tennessee. How cool is that? And he wanted me to show how I start training the command workshop. When I say workshop, Sergeant comes out here to my workshop and he gets on the concrete. But he has to have all four feet on the concrete before I reward him with the toy or the chuck it ball or whatever it is he's wanting. Ruby loves this. So we're just going to try to see if we can get her to get on the workshop. She doesn't like to do it. We usually just work all over the property. I've never really done. I've done this a couple of times just to see if she would do it to practice for this video. But Chuck, here you go. Chuck in Tennessee. Ruby, come. Good girl. Stay. You want this ball? Good girl. You want it? Ruby, workshop. Good girl, Ruby. Wow. Wow. I only did this a couple of times practicing with her and she would not do it until I coaxed her up there. Man, next time we're going to see if she'll do it just with the hand signal. Now I'm going to give her what she wants. Good girl, Ruby. Workshop. Good girl. You got to reward them. I should have rewarded her within a second. I was just kind of like wowed because she <laughs> just did it. Good girl, Ruby. Workshop. Uh -uh -uh. Stay on the workshop. Good girl. Good girl. Ruby, get that. Now, she'll go get that ball, and she'll bring it back to me, and that's going to set the high drive dogs off. She knows to drop it within Juan's reach. Ruby, workshop. Ah, no, correct within a second. If they don't do something, don't keep saying workshop, 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 and they finally do it. Good girl, you just trained them to do workshop on the fifth command. Eh, nope, one time. If they don't do it, eh, correction, start over. Clear their mind, just start over. Ruby, now this time instead of just saying it, I, since she did so well last time, go Ruby, that's a good girl. Ruby, workshop, good girl Ruby. Within a second of that fourth foot hitting the concrete, I want to reward her. Ruby, get. Now I'm talking. I would normally reward her. Good girl, Ruby, within a second, and then throw the ball immediately. Good girl, Ruby. Good girl, Ruby. No vocal command, just, ah, oh, no, 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 that ain't gonna fly. Ruby. Good girl, Ruby. Workshop. Good girl. Workshop. Wow. Okay. Good girl, Ruby. Workshop. Good girl, Ruby. Okay. Good girl, Ruby. Good girl, Ruby. Wow. Man. I've only practiced with her a couple of times. Of course, now she's a well-defined, well-trained animal. Uh-oh, she lost it. Bring it here. Drop. Good girl, drop. That's a good girl, Wooby. Let me come up here a little closer to you, Jay, and get in the shade. Is that okay? That's how you train placing somewhere in the yard. It doesn't just have to be workshop. Maybe you have a pool and you have a gate going to the pool. You could do the same thing instead of workshop. You could train your dogs with something that moves them. Could be a piece of hot dog, could be a chuck it ball, but something that moves your dog. You could use the term pool gate and point toward the pool gate. And you may have to take them right over there to it like I did her to start with, 
take take your dog right up to the pool gate. Good boy, good girl, pool gate. And then give them the ball or give them the toy or give them the hot dog or give them whatever, whatever it is they want, whatever it is you're moving them with. You with me? Okay. So it could be workshop. It could be pool, pool gate. Now, I have a front deck on my house with a pergola over it. And the word for that is deck. When I say deck, Sergeant, for instance, he knows to run, get up on the deck. I don't even have to say deck. All I have to do is that and point at the deck. He runs and gets on the deck. You can do it with truck. I can say, you ready to go? Truck, boom, come sit right at the back door of the truck, ready to load up. It's a simple thing. And I do what I call a state training. I want my dogs to flow properly here on the real estate footprint. People ask me, are your dogs protection trained? No, they have protection in them, but I train them to match the estate. When I say workshop, I want them to go to the workshop. When I say truck, I want them to go to the truck. When I say kitchen, I want them to go to the back stoop, which is the back door, which I just use the word kitchen. You could use the word cadiddle hopper. It doesn't matter. Any word will work as long as you use it consistently and you correct within a second when they don't do proper behavior and you reward within a second when they do. Ruby, get. She loves that. Now, how do you do that? How do you get an adult dog like that? You start molding the puppy properly. If you just got a puppy or you're getting a puppy, thinking about getting a puppy, whatever you do, get my personal puppy training system. The link is in the description below. Ruby, bring it here. Drop. Good girl. All this starts with the right kind of puppy molding. Thank all of you from all of us, GermanShepherdMan.com.